Hey, welcome to the nursery, finally. So I did mention in a video that we have been documenting the nursery remakeover thing for a big video. We'll probably wind up posting towards the end of the year, but I'm definitely gonna show you guys stuff along the way in case any of you are expecting or are looking into like what we wound up picking up and why. I have a room <laughs> full of stuff from our registry that I'm working on organizing, so I figured I'd show you guys as I organize. And yeah, I mean, this is the painted wall. This is my glider. And uh, I'll take you on a really quick tour first, and then we can start looking at all of the baby stuff. Okay, so this is the glider I picked out. Scott and I did purchase this at Bye Bye Baby. I think it's gonna actually be a little moved over. There's gonna be a table here. But this is from the brand, I think it's called Da Vinci. It's really nice. I really wanted something with a ottoman and oh, the ottoman opens for extra storage which i liked for like blankies and maybe stuffed animals i thought that would be nice here's the crib so the crib is from target and we also have the matching dresser and kind of changing table area i think we're going to get some sort of a tower over here so i can just have like right up and easy access like diapers and wipes this is luigi's favorite room <laughs> Mario's here too. Uh, the prints I bought from Etsy. The frames are from Amazon. So much to go through. Let me put you guys, okay, let me put you guys on the ottoman. Hold on. I know I'm looking real stylish right now. We can do a baby haul. It's probably gonna be a lot of baby hauls in these vlogs. Oh, and that's the closet. So I mentioned Scott put um, bifold doors on this closet. So he painted them white and I painted the knobs. That was my contribution, the color of the walls. So one thing I wanted to show you guys is I bought this from Etsy too. This is our baby book. I haven't started filling it out or anything yet, but I really, really liked the, um, the quality in it and all the things. And since we are doing a jungle themed nursery, I thought this one was really cute. I'll link the, the, um, the Etsy shop below. We'll start with this little container here. This is called my things I need to wash. So it's all blankies and clothes right now. So Scott's sister, Allie, bought us this. This was on our registry. This wasn't something I had like seen rec recommended anywhere, but we are having a winter baby. <laughs> so I definitely wanted something really warm to be able to cover the baby, especially like in the car seat. And this is just like a really, really fluffy, like Sherpa kind of feeling blankie. It's from the brand Cloud Island. It says, I love you all over it. Thought it was really cute. We got a set of PJs from his sister, Lisa. <laughs> These are newborn size. I tried to put a bunch of um, like the zipper onesies on our registry for easy use. So this set has like little animals. This one's just like little stripes. And this one's like little clouds and stars. Ah, the infamous onesie that I got for, for our, <laughs> our announcement photo. So this one, I also got on Etsy. One of my college roommates bought this for the baby. Uh, I think she got this from Amazon. I can try to link it, but how cute is that? Um, my Bubby, these were on our registry too. These are from the brand Aiden and Anis, Anasis. I don't know how to say it. Uh, these are swaddles. These are really cute. They're actually like dinosaur. Well, these ones are at least, so I thought these were cute. And then she also bought us two of these um, crib sheets. This was also on our registry. This is from the brand Little Unicorn. And these are just like jungly leaves for the jungle theme. So that's everything on my to clean. So once my um, my Grove Collaborative order shows up with my laundry detergent, I'll start washing stuff and putting it away. I actually bought this from Target. Um, it's just a storage bin, but it matches a lot of the stuff in the room. So I don't know when we stored it yet. I'm still deciding how I want to organize everything, but I like that one. This is where Luigi spends his safe time. He feels so safe under here. I actually think our mattress is getting delivered today. So I don't know how he's gonna feel about that. There's a couple more things. Uh, his sister Allie also bought us the Woba Nub. I have that on our registry. I'm gonna make, put this in a container. I'm gonna start off things that need to be sanitized. Uh, my Bubby also got this off our registry. This is the um, one of the baby carriers I picked up. I also got one of the like fabric-y ones. Uh, that's also on our registry, but this one is more like the one that helps with back support and stuff. Uh, his sister, Lisa, got this off our registry. This is um like one of those little water mats for tummy time. It's got like little fishies in it. Uh, this is not from our registry. This is the letter board 
that you also saw in the announcement video. This is awesome. I'm so excited. I didn't even realize how nice this was when I ordered it. So this is the letter board. And then it comes with this big box that has all of the letters and symbols and different things in it. So this is probably what I'll use for different like monthly milestones and stuff because it can be reused for so many different things. Did I say that was from Amazon? I'm going to try to link as many things as I possibly can. Uh, something else his sister Lisa bought from our registry was the diaper bag. So actually I put Scott in charge of a lot of the registry. So there was a decent amount that I was in charge of, but there were certain things where I knew he's really good at like looking up specs and stuff. And I actually let him pick out the diaper bag. And I said, all I really cared about was that it was like a backpack one. So this one's from Amazon. The front is um, insulated for bottles. It like has like um, a metal rim, so it kind of can sit open. It's got ooh, like a ton of storage compartments in there. I really, I really do like it. He did a good job. Another gift my bubby bought from the registry is uh, our bouncer chair. I picked a jungly one. It's got like a little sloth and an elephant. It's pretty cute. And then his sister Lisa bought this off our registry. It's a travel bassinet that like folds up. I found it on Amazon, I thought it looked really cool. His sister Allie also bought us the pack and play I picked out. So that's what this is. <laughs> this bag is a combination. So this bag is mainly full of the stuff I got. We got from signing up for the, our Bye Bye Baby registry. And then actually when I ordered a pair of leggings from Motherhood Maternity, they sent me a lot of stuff too. So I thought that was cool. Target, every time we go, we keep forgetting to get our registry gift. So we still have to do that. But Amazon, I did sign up for our registry gift, so it should be coming soon. So in here we have a Phillips Avent bottle. That will be going in the to sanitize pile. Actually, let me grab a couple containers. There are lots and lots of coupons, so I'm gonna kind of store them all together. So we got um, some Aveeno Baby like body wash and shampoo. Uh, this is a Dr. Brown's bottle that goes in the to sanitize. This is a free to mom postpartum kit. I don't actually know what it comes with. What is it? Uh, oh, a pair of underwear. Uh, lots of coupons we got, what is this? This is from Noodle and & Boo and it's a body wash and a lotion. Ah, bye bye baby on board. Should we make Scott put that on his car? Look like a real dad. Uh, this is the Waleda diaper rash cream. Uh, this is nursing pads and breast milk storage bags. This is a little grape water. I didn't even open this. We got a bunch of stuff. Coupons, coupons, baby wipes. Coupons, coupons. Uh, is this dra uh, draft laundry detergent? And then this. I think this is like a changing. Oh. We got one diaper. Yeah, and this is like a, a little changing pad that probably just put in the diaper bag. So that's cool. I have a couple other things. <laughs> Let me just, I don't feel like getting up right now. Mario loves the ottoman. So this obviously had a rough transit, but this is the bassinet. Uh, we're gonna open it up and check it out. The bassinet is one of those other categories of things I let Scott pick out. He's really good at like researching and like looking up specs and stuff. So there's some things that he was in charge of. Uh, downstairs in a box also. So my bubby did pick out the bassinet and she also picked, she not picked out, uh, ordered. And she also ordered the, what am I saying? Ordered the stroller. And that's downstairs in a large box. Um, I'm going to put all this away and yeah. That's it for right now. I forgot a couple things. So I also ordered these off of Etsy for the closet. So they have different jungle animals with the dividers. And then I forgot my parents ordered us books. So this is one of like our favorite books growing up. And this uh, Sandra Boynton, we used to have a lot of them. So they bought us like a little pack and I love Dr. Seuss books. They're like my absolute favorites. So they got us the cat in the hat and the cat in the hat comes back. It's exciting because I have already ordered the bookshelf and I ordered a rug. I'm looking into a side table. So it's a lot of exciting things. So yesterday, I just, 
kind of the steps, can't breathe. We built the bassinet so it can get taller. This is as short as it gets and this section can get lower. So it can drop a lot lower and be like a lot taller. This guy, he's obsessed with it. So yeah, built that. He's hungry. Now we are going, we're going to set up the stroller, make sure we like the stroller that we picked out, make sure it's not missing any pieces, which is why we did the bassinet. And yeah, that's the plan. This is your first time in the post baby vlog. Yes, it is. What are you doing? Post baby? Well, post reveal of the baby. Okay. So what are you doing? Cutting over, cutting over, cutting open the stroller to verify there are no missing parts or anything. And you picked out the stroller yourself? What were your top three things you were looking for? I wanted something affordable, something that had, it, we were looking for a, uh, what's called travel system. So you could take the, um, the car seat, the car seat is the stroller and the stroller is the car seat. And something that's, I guess, durable and grow with us, I don't know. Okay, so we'll probably check back in once we have it all put together. Jeez. Just drop the baby in. All right, can you take it for, can you show us how? Let me see you, baby. Okay. All right, let's see. How does it work? Does it, you have to unlock the wheels. Okay. Wow. Look at you, daddy. Let's go for a run. Yo, coming at you from the nursery with my decaf coffee. Never did I ever think I'd say that I was somebody who drank decaf coffee. But we got something else from our registry today and I wanted to show you. So what we got was gift wrapped and I thought it would be cool to show you. I have never gotten anything sent to me from Amazon that was gift wrapped. So I thought it was cool to see like they, it's like a really like thick, well-made like gift bag. I was actually really impressed. I figured it would just be like gift wrap, but this is cool because it's like reusable. Anywho, this is from my brother and sister-in-law. And if you listened to our podcast this past week, we actually talked about the lollipop baby camera. This is something on our registry we were really excited to get. So this is actually something that I heard as a recommendation from both Ashley Clady and Makeup Molly. So like this was kind of in the back of my mind as a baby monitor I'd be interested in. So I actually said to Scott, like, why don't you research baby monitors and see which one like you think sounds the best? So we could kind of compare what, what we were both thinking and he actually came up with a lollipop too. So it seemed like the best option. I think it comes in three, op three colors, green, blue, and pink. And I figured blue would match our nursery the best especially because the um the wall is actually like a blue gray i don't know how well that comes off on camera we have a couple things that are supposed to be getting delivered today my parents ordered us a mattress for this crib and it's been taking weeks to get here i don't know what the issue is like my mom wound up contacting target and they said i don't a new one because the first one wasn't coming and now this one says it's supposed to be here today and it still isn't and i'm like where is it? And then I also got an email saying that the bookshelf is supposed to be delivered today, but I think it's gonna come tomorrow. The rug is getting delivered tomorrow. Did I say I ordered a table finally to go here? It's actually a table with three drawers. So I think that'll be nice for the nursing area. And that is happening. <laughs> oh, I wanted to say that a bunch of you guys have been asking for my registry information. Please do not think you need to send me anything. Um, I will link my registry down below, but please do not think you have to send anything. Like honestly, just you guys being positive and happy for me, like that is more than enough gift. Like this has, this, that, like everyone's reactions to the video was just like so exciting for us. Like we don't need you guys to send us stuff, but if you do, please like include some sort of a return information for me so that I can send you guys thank you cards because 
I, I want you to know how much I appreciate you guys. But please, again, you do not need to send anything. Like, please. Oh, yeah, I think that's it for today. I have um, a test tomorrow. I have the nuchal screening, nuchal test, integrated screening. Uh, that is in the hospital. That's going to be my first time going to the hospital to be tested. I've only had like two um, ultrasounds at my OBGYN so far. And it's kind of exciting because both of our, both of my ultras, both, both of my ultrasounds Scott couldn't be at because the OBGYN doesn't allow guests right now because of the pandemic. But the hospital is now allowing one visitor. So he's going to be able to get to come with me to this appointment. So that's like a big deal now. And yes, I think that is it for today. Good morning. Hey. Happy Tuesday. Right? 13th week? Yeah. <laughs> I had my nuchal screening today. Basically an ultrasound. We got a new pick. Where's a little, little bugger? Uh, measuring a little bigger than they originally measured. So we might be a little bit into our 13th week and not just in our 12th week. So that's kind of teasing. Everything looks good. This yeah. was Scott's first experience, experience experiencing a ultrasound in person. Yeah. How was your experience? I think, well, I've gotten an ultrasound before for my um, uh, tibia when I had an injury. They, they Sometimes for injuries, they'll, they'll do ultrasound. Uh, do you think that PT. was as interesting? No, I didn't get to see what was inside my bone. So, did you enjoy this experience? This was, well, yeah. It was really interesting getting to see the baby wiggle. Very wiggly limbs. So... She kept saying, yeah, this is the... That's your baby wiggle It was funny. She she kept trying to make the baby move into a different yeah, position, so she, she kept, kept poking. jiggling my stomach. <laughs> that was an experience I've like, never experienced. I was like, you're poking my baby. <laughs> so, um, we have a bunch of deliveries, apparently, out for deliveries, so I guess we'll be updating you later with the deliveries. But I'm pretty sure our rug is going to be delivered today, and that's exciting. The cats will be excited to have something new to sit on. So, never wound up updating the vlog yesterday, mainly because we were busy doing a lot in the nursery. So I figured that I could show you guys some stuff today. I have been having such a tired day. I took this many naps. Very tired. A couple things. So Mario's showing off one of the items. I got this rug from Bye Bye Baby. What I like about Bye Bye Baby is they seem to send us 20% off coupons a lot. So that's what I did with the glider and now I did it with the rug. And then for a bookshelf, Scott said he likes like cubes, but I wanted to get something like a little bit nicer than just like a typical cube storage that you would just like get at Lowe's. So I found this at Target and it's like a really good size. Like it's pretty close to the same size as the dresser. And I figure uh, it can hold toys and books because it's a nice size. All oh, right, and we did get a mattress. The mattress was delivered. There is a uh, bed sheet on it right now because Mario has figured out how to jump in and I don't want his little toes going through the mattress. So we have this to catch his landing. And then the last thing I picked out was a side table for right here. So, so this is from Target. It actually was on sale for a pretty good price and I had a gift card to Target, so that helped. The actual bedroom set did have a side table option, but it was a lot wider than what I was looking for for right here. And this one is like a little over a foot. And I really wanted something that I could like keep things in. And then like there's also enough room up here for like a lamp and like a water bottle. So those were kind of my requirements. But those are the updates. There is one thing that I ordered actually off my Amazon registry <laughs> because I wanted to see if I like them. So I ordered this. It's... It's this closet storage box, <laughs> but they're basically like boxes that I can organize the actual drawers with. I was thinking I could use this to organize like pajamas and burp cloths and 
swaddles and all that stuff in these drawers. I have like a couple different versions of this set in my registry and I wanted to make sure like that I actually like the quality and stuff and that like it is what I'm looking for before I receive all of them. Other than that, I'm just trying to get through this week. I'm very tired, very, very tired. Um, I was definitely up very early this morning. I could not fall back asleep after I woke up to go to the bathroom, but Luigi was really nice and he cuddled me. So you win some and you lose some. The next project for this room is hanging the mirror, but I want to touch up a couple paint spots and we haven't really fully decided where we want to hang it yet. And I don't just want to like hang it up without really deciding. My Grove order was shipped. So once that gets here, I'll do that haul probably in the next vlog. And then I'll start washing like a lot of the blankets and clothes that we got. So I can start putting them away. But yeah, I mean, yeah, there's a lot to do. We have like a busy couple of days ahead of us. I need to go downstairs and clean a little. It's just constant yawning. Yeah, that's it for now. I'm back. We had a couple of packages arrive this evening. First one is very exciting. It's my boppy. First of all, I love that the boppy has all the little jungle animals on it, but this was a gift from Tiffany Johnson. So thank you so much, Tiffany. I have been watching Tiffany maybe since before I was making videos. She does like a lot of unboxings on her channel and she just had a little boy, I think like six months ago. Is that how old Ridgely is now? But yeah, I'll definitely link Tiffany's channel down below and it was so nice of her to get me the boppy. And then a gift came from Scott's mom. I'm gonna try my hardest to show you. Uh, you know what, I'm just gonna point at the box. So she ordered us our swing. This is the Snugga Puppy Swing. So I think I was recommended this watching one of Madison Miller's videos. Why I liked this one because it can swing side to side or back and forth, which I thought was kind of cool. But uh, it has like a little puppy on it. It's got some animals hanging from it, but yeah, it seemed good. So we're excited for this one too. And now that is it for today. I have one last update for the vlog. We did get another set of crib sheets in from my bubby and these were also on our target registry and these have just like zebra, lion, bear, and elephant. So sweet dreams, super cute. Also going in the to clean pile. I think my Grove order is getting delivered today so I might just film it in like a collective haul that I'm gonna film this week. If it's not in that video, then it will be in the next vlog. Just kind of depends how timing works out with this, but that is it for this vlog. See you in the next one.